the Bree R32 Ultra systems will work with the 24 volt thermostat without hooking up the H1 and H2 between the indoor and outdoor unit. But out of the box, they won't unless you set the dip switches. So there's a set of sw dip switches in the outdoor unit that are mar marked SA1. And there's a set of dip switches on the indoor air handler that is marked SA1. So switch number one needs to be turned on on both indoor and outdoor of the SA1 dip switch. Then you don't have to hook up H1 and H2. It will work with the 24 volt thermostat. But you're better off to leave those dip switches off, hook up H1 and H2 between the outdoor units, even if you're not going to use the RS485 degree controller, still hook up H1 and H2 between the indoor and the outdoor unit, then you do not have to set them dip switches and it will still work with 24 volt. Once the three service tool comes available for the flux, that's going to be an advantage to you by having those hooked up. You'll be able to plug into the pigtail both on the indoor unit or the outdoor unit and read the data from both machines because they are communicating. So the big advantage to making sure you go ahead and hook those wires up. If you use an 18-8 thermostat wire, you should have enough wires to be able to hook up the H1 and H2 and still have enough wires for your thermostat connection. So you should be able to just run one 18-8 cable from the outdoor unit to the indoor unit, two of those wires being your H1 and H2.